To Her With Love is a really enjoyable film. This was released in 2022. It's directed by Stan Foster and written by Tyler Stresson. And it stars Sky P. Marshall as Kayla and Tobias Trevelyan as Jordan. And at the start of the film, Kayla is let go from a teaching position because she was just doing some cover for somebody who was on sick leave. And she does manage to get another position. And she joins the faculty of this school's art department. And the film is slightly about her growing relationship with Jordan, who is also uh, on the faculty, but mostly about how she inspires the children to embrace the artists within and to create art that really reflects who they are. And I love films like that. And what I particularly love... And this is quite unusual for a film like this, is that it doesn't just focus on one type of art. Usually, not exclusively, but usually with these films, it will be a, a music teacher who encourages children to embrace creativity through music or an art teacher encouraging them to draw or paint or whatever. But this one actually incorporates quite a wide variety of different formats. And I think that that worked really well. It definitely can help to make it more relatable for a wider range of people. And I did find it genuinely inspirational and also really important. There is one moment in this that I absolutely loved and I really want to praise it. There's also something that I didn't love. And I'll talk about both of those with a spoiler warning in a moment. But what I was going to say before I interrupted myself was that I love how it celebrates the importance not just of art but of having art departments in a school everywhere schools are being forced to cancel art programs cut back on art funding and often the people in charge don't see the benefit in the arts and this film really helps to highlight just how important and beneficial the arts are. And I absolutely love that. The characters are all really, really likeable. No problems there at all. The performances are really great. The pacing of the film is brilliant. And I, I had a lot of fun with it and I found it to be very moving and very inspiring. If you're looking for an uplifting film with a great narrative, really likeable characters and some really great performances, then To Her With Love is definitely worth checking out. I will now mention, with a spoiler warning, two things. One thing that I thought was brilliant, and one that I I didn't hate it, but I don't think it needed to be there. And I will explain both of those now. And the thing that I want to praise is the school show. We get to see this art show that they put on. And we don't see it in real time. It is a montage of the different performances. And then we have one of the characters reciting this this poem that they've written about the importance of art and the words in that poem are beautiful and the editing there is fantastic and I really thoroughly enjoyed it. I think they did a fantastic job with that and they should have ended the film just after that, maybe another couple of minutes but after that we actually have another maybe 15-20 minutes and there are two reasons why I think they should have ended it there or thereabouts. One, that would be a very, very powerful way to end the film. The other reason is that the events that come after this I didn't like. I didn't care for them. I didn't like some of the characters' actions. I didn't like some of the decisions the characters made. And they definitely just wanted to do that dance scene. And I honestly thought it was cheesy and corny and unnecessary. And I think it kind of ruined the ending. It didn't ruin the film. still really enjoyed the film. But if they'd maybe just cut off the last kind of 10, 15 minutes and just ended things as soon as possible after the art show, that would have been perfect because everything was ending on a high. Pretty much everything had come to a natural conclusion by this point. We would have needed a few minutes to wrap up a few things, but otherwise it felt like everything was ready to finish and then they extended it and I just didn't care for it. It didn't feel necessary and I didn't enjoy it. But it didn't overshadow how much I enjoyed the rest of the film, which is a really good thing, of course. So needless to say, To Her With Love is one that I really thoroughly enjoyed and I'm very happy to recommend this one.